at this point not knowing who it is, I'm a little concerned about it being one of my neighbors or somebody that lives around here. One man is dead after a train truck crash in Clay County. Good evening and thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Robert Hahn. Krista Baim is off. Deputies say this morning a driver went through the crossing arms at 60th Avenue South near Highway 75 in Moorhead. The driver's vehicle was then struck by the train. Valley News Team's Macy Anger has more on why neighbors say this isn't a surprise. I thought, oh, there must have been a car hit by a train. Crews rushed to the scene to find a truck caught under a train, engulfed in flames. It's sad to see anything like that happen. I'm sure there's family going to be grieving over this. Witnesses told deputies the driver drove through the crossing arm and was hit by the train, dragging the truck down the track, killing the driver. Clay County Sheriff says officers don't know the circumstances around this crash. Uh, whether uh, he had a medical condition or something like that, we don't know that. Neighbors say this isn't the first time they've seen a train crash in their own backyard. It's fast traffic on this road, and I can see where people, if they're not, if they're texting or doing some other silly thing, uh, they're not going to see the crossing lights or anything like that. At the time of the crash, BNSF says the crossing arms were believed to have been down and working. We do have a couple of good witnesses that, you know, will be interviewed and we'll probably get a little more information from that too. Deputies say they'll continue to investigate until they know more. Near Moorhead, Macy Inger, Valley News Live. BNSF is conducting its own investigation along with the Clay County Sheriff's Department. We'll continue to bring the latest developments on Valley News Live and ValleyNewsLive.com. And coming up on Valley News Live 10 at 10, we will have more information from another witness that saw the whole thing unfold.